Hello, welcome. In this short video, let us look at the value of the gamma function at 1 by 2. That is, we want to look at the value of gamma of 1 by 2, gamma of half. By definition, gamma of n is given by the integral 0 to infinity x power n minus 1 e power minus x dx. Therefore, gamma of 1 by 2, that is gamma of half is given by integral 0 to infinity x power minus 1 by 2 e power minus x dx. Now by using change of variables that is x equal to v square which implies dx equal to 2v times dv and for x equal to 0 v is 0 and for x equal to infinity v is also equal to infinity. So the function becomes integral 0 to infinity v squared power minus 1 by 2 e power minus v square to 2 v dv and clearly this becomes the first term becomes v square power minus 1 by 2 becomes v, v power minus 1 and which cancels with the v here so we are so we have 2 times integral 0 to infinity e power minus v square dv now we have to determine the value of this integral for a Gaussian density, with mean mu equal to 0 and variance equal to 1 by 2, the area under the Gaussian density, which is equal to 1, is equal to integral minus infinity to plus infinity 1 by square root of 2 pi times the variance, which is 1 by 2 into exponential of minus minus v minus 0 whole square divided by 2 times the variance which is 1 by 2 2 times 1 by 2 dv that is the area of this pdf is equal to 1 therefore this becomes integral minus infinity to plus infinity 1 by square root of pi exponential of minus v square because this is 2 times 1 by 2 which is 1. Therefore, we are left with exponential of minus v square dv is equal to 1. Since this integrand is an even function, we can rewrite the integral as 2 times integral 0 to infinity e exponential of exponential of minus v square dv is equal to square root of pi. And that is the integral we have here. That is 2 times integral 0 to infinity e power minus v square dv which is exactly same as the integral we have here which is equal to square root of pi therefore gamma of 1 by 2 is equal to square root of pi thus by using the area of gaussian pdf we can determine the value of gamma function at 1 by 2 as square root of pi thanks for watching